Jackson, how would you assess the first half for you guys as a whole? Um, I think it was good. Obviously, we um, our schedule was tough, and we found a way to win a bunch of games. So that's that's definitely positive. Um, then yeah, just trying the consistency for me was the biggest part. We had that kind of throughout the whole half, and um, to be able to do that as a team is a really good thing. How about personally? How do you assess the first half? Um, started to heat up towards the end, I think. Um, just getting some more time in the lineup, some consistency um, from game to game, so that was good. How about playing in the, the net front at the power play? Is that something that, you know, I know you did that a little bit in Green Bay? Yeah, I did. I've kind of been doing that my whole life, so it's very comfor comfortable for me. Um, and to be able to get that opportunity is, is, is cool. What are some keys to playing that position well? Um, just getting the goalie's eyes. That's kind of the biggest thing. Um, take away his eyes so that the guys that can shoot have can shoot around me and have net to shoot at. What happened on the, the, the pass from Berg? Um, well, yeah, I kind of went up and around through Liver to Berg. He took a one-timer, and um, I had my stick on the ice. Unfortunately, it went in. What do you want to see in the second half? Um, more of the same thing from, from the team. I think we're rolling, and we have a really good squad, as, as everyone can see. So I think just continuing to uh, have that consistency. How do you guys, you know, you'll probably play some teams like CC that are very structured in the second half, maybe even Alaska. Um, how do you guys break through against teams that are really structured? Um, I think it's just sticking to what we do best. Um, obviously, there's pre-scouting teams and whatnot, but um, we have great D, great offensive skill, great goaltending. So I think just doing what we know we can do will, will be the recipe for us. How do you spend the break? Um, I'll stay where I'm living now. Obviously, I'm from here. Me, Dane, and Cheese live together, so we kind of hang out. And then obviously, we'll go to our parents' house throughout break a little bit, too. Still works. Um, Schloss touched on it a little bit, but the fact that pretty much all of your goals have been in the same kind of area, um, mm -hmm. just what is it maybe that makes you so confident and dominant um, besides just your size? Um, well, obviously my size and my strength um, makes it kind of hard for defenders to um, defend me there, I guess. And just my whole life, it's come naturally around that area. And um, I think to finally see it continue to be a, a success for me here is it, it um, makes me happy. Uh, and just the importance of being on a positive front moving forward in the break. Obviously, this isn't the way you wanted to close it, but mm -hmm. it seems like the team is looking ahead. Yeah, we know. I mean, we know we're a good team, and we know what we can do, like I said. But um, obviously, the last three games are a little hiccup, and I guess no season ever really goes smoothly the whole way. And these times of adversity are good for any team in any league. But uh, for us to go through that, I think it'll be good for us, and we'll, we'll grow from it. When you go halfway through a season, only losing two games in regulation, it says you're doing some things right. Yeah, I mean, it's hard to win in this league, and it's, um, yeah, there's not many words. I guess it's a good feeling for us as a team, and um, the coaching staff preaches it too. Like, uh, we know we know what we can do. We just got to stick to what what we do right.